Welcome back to my blind Nuzlocke of the Indigo Disc. And let's start right away with a battle because I have seven battles in the Savannah area and I think I can push it to ten before we find that Elite Four member. Start staring up at the Terrarium Core on this ceiling gave me a real crick in my neck. Well, let's see what you got. Listen to the music. Yoshiki of the Student. You know what? Um, okay, Araquanid and Zeb Strika, dude. I I love. <laughs> I am absolutely loving when uh, when they send out a pair of Pokemon that are like, oh, it's level seventy five. How am I under leveled? I guess I'm under leveled in all of this, so I'm gonna have to swap out. Obviously, if you're gonna take a, you're gonna take something. You're like a Thunderbolt or something. So let's see. If you take a Thunderbolt, I want Raven out here. And as for as for a Rockwinid, I don't have any grass moves, but man, if I did, I swear. Let's go let's go Swords Dance. Oh man. These uh these battles are definitely no joke. <laughs> I've already lost one Pokemon to just regular battles around here. These guys are level 75. Flame charge. Nearly takes me out. I did not predict that at all. Flame charge on Caesar. I am so glad that I have naturally high defense because that could have been bad. Uh, uh, Aqua Ring. Otherwise, he probably easily could have taken out Caesar. So, um, let's go. Do I want to Calm Mind up? I could Calm Mind. Um, but you know what? You're using physical attacks. Zeb Striker, you have to go. Now, if he's going to use a flame charge, um, every... Why... Every Pokemon I have is weak to uh, fire except for you. I need to fix this. Obviously, I've got a team comp problem. Every single Pokemon in my arsenal is weak to fire. Well, at least, you know, four-sixths of the team are. All right, get out of here, Lapras. Eat that flame charge. All right, Psychic. I know your speed is super high, so... Hopefully, I can knock you down pretty hard with this Psychic. That's pretty good. If I had Bullet Punch still, man, I would love to use that. Water Absorb, thank you very much. All right. Uh, let's go Psychic again on the Zeb Strika. And as for you, let's go Ice Beam on the Araquanid. Time to attack. Supercell Slam, dodge. I was going to say, if it weren't for my... Kept going and crashed. I saw the red for just a second. I was like... I thought, the only reason I thought Lapras could take that is because if he used something electric, Lapras is really defensive and high HP. But the fact that I saw that HP bar and I was like, oh my god, in a Nuzlocke, you do not want to see an HP bar above your Pokemon that shows that your Pokemon has fainted. Smeargle, you're just standing there watching. What, what you an admirer? Hey, look. <laughs> look, secretly, Smeargle was the team leader the whole time. He's the Pokemon trainer. All right, let's go Psychic and finish this guy off. Uh, the only, thankfully, he didn't have four Pokemon because that would have been a problem. Dude, there was an Elite Trainer, and I'm I'm realizing now when I, especially when I edited it, it said Elite or League member, League member. See, Yoshika the student. I'm guessing if I find another League member, at the shock of losing a great distraction from my neck pain. Oh, the shock of losing. You're too young to have ne neck pain, bro. So I saw that it said League member, and I was like, dude, these League members obviously are way stronger than the regular guys. So, But I only find out, I guess, when I get close to them and see their name is League member. All right, let's go. Onwards. That's eight trainers. I wonder how many more I can even find. Knocking out some BBQs. I didn't know what those were when I first got to Blueberry Academy, so it made no sense. I saw it, and I was like, he always talking about his barbecue? I'm doing some BBQs with my pals during our breaks in between classes. Let's battle. You are challenged by S Sukasa, the student who um, has a problem. I don't know what kind of problem you got, but it ain't me. In fact, I'm about to give you another one. He's a little angry. Smeargle and Giraffe Rig. Now, you know, at least I'm, uh, I'm kind of getting back to normality here. It's level 75, so I need to up the... I, I obviously need to up my Pokemon's level. This is, uh, this is interesting. <laughs> All right, let's go Leaf Storm on the Giraffe. No, don't use Leaf Storm. Sorry, use Psybeam. If he, yeah, if that Smeargle sketches my, uh, in fact, you know what? I should almost, I should almost use Worry Seed. Let's go Reflect and Sing. 
I think because he's going to sketch me. Of course, you have Thunderbolt. Ow. Um, I hope that Endeavor. Okay, never mind. You're not sketching. I Don't ask me why I thought he was going to be sketching, but apparently I shouldn't have done that. All right, so here's a sing, and uh, we're going to take you out. I was thinking I need to blow some moves that I don't mind him sketching, but obviously, it, that, I guess if an enemy uses... If an enemy uses sketch, uh, that's or I shouldn't say if he's already sketched prior to this battle, he could have anything, dude. Literally, he he could have uh, he could have dark void. Although, thankfully, one of the funny ooh extreme speed, nice. If that hit harder, or if that was uh, if you were a better Pokemon, then that would uh, hit harder, and then I would be at threat if another another Thunderbolt came in. So one of the funny things is. Uh, Oh, you missed. Oh, Sap Sipper. Dang it. Oh, you have Sap Sipper, dude. I, Giraffe Rig, sometimes I really forget what the heck you even have. Use Ice Beam. If he wakes up, we got a problem. If he wakes up, we got a serious problem. Good. So, I, I forget sometimes um, how crazy it was with Smeargle back in the day. Smeargle could learn Dark Void from Darkrai. <laughs> now, thankfully... Dark Rise signature move, Dark Void, it literally one of the stipulations. It doesn't even say this in the move. It's just a check that's made in the background. But uh, only Dark Rise can use that move. But uh, having a Dark Void smear goal, man. All right. Hits me with Endeavor. He goes down. If I can find one more trainer, that'll be 10 trainers in this area, and I'll be happy to go face the Elite Four member. Let's do one more trainer battle without healing. Beating you is a quest I'll never be able to complete. All right, I'm going to meet you guys wherever I can find one more trainer on the way to the Elite Four, and then that'll be it. That'll be 10 trainers in this area. I'll be satisfied per the Nuzlocke that that is, a, uh, that is enough trainers. Right in the middle of the terrarium. Dude, how freaking long do I have to look around for a trainer? Well, trainer number 10 says, do you know what you'll find right in the middle of the terrarium? You, apparently. Not only was I looking forever for you, but I had to clear my throat about 5,000 5, times. Riley the student. She looks prestigious for my final battle. Alchemy and Rabska. I just saw Rabska not that long ago. And what's weird about Rabska is, like, I never see anybody use it. And I was just thinking, don't sneeze again, man. I, that, that's what took so long the first time. I'm not gonna, Nope, I'm not going to sneeze. All right. So you're a bug psychic type is what my worry is. In fact, I know exactly what I'm going to do. Boom, protect. Now for you, I say, what do we want to go with? Yeah, we want to go with Moonblast on the Rabska. Try and take that thing out. I don't need that bug type because I'm going to have to switch out is what's going to happen here. Um, what do I think they're going to use? I think Alchemy is probably going to use Dazzling Gleam. And I called that one 100%. And then Rabska, since you're a special attacker, I'm seeing like Bug Bite, Struggle Bug. Struggle Bug indeed. Oh, man, dude. Executor, a uh, stay of execution on this one. All right, that is... Ooh, special attack dropped. Yeah, that's right. Um, Well, I can't do that again, can I? Let's go Leaf Storm on... No, you know what? I want to use Psy Beam on the... No. I definitely want to make sure I'm using Psy Beam and attack with uh, Moon Blast. I want to take that thing out because Struggle Bug is going to be lethal, dude. Alchemy used Protect. Yeah, somebody got an idea. You saw me do it, and you're like, ooh, this is a good idea. I'm going to do that. All right, kill him. Now his special attack is down as well, and you're not going to live to see another day anyways. All right, Rabska's down. Oh, I zoomed in on Alchemy. I'm like, Alchemy, do you have an ability that I don't know about? Like, why is it zooming in on you? Um, all right, so let's see. What do I want to do here? I think the next thing I do is Leaf Storm on Alchemy, and my healing item allotted for this battle is about to get burned up. Actually, I'm going to use a Max Potion. Um, all right, there we go. I, well, technically, Trainer Battles, I get two. I'm allotting two healing items for myself, and then uh, three for Elite Four. So I have three healing items when I fight the Elite Four. Dazzling Gleam, I probably didn't even need to heal, to be honest. I probably could have just attacked. Nice. All right. Now everyone's special attack has taken a hit. Uh, go ahead and hit with a Psybeam 
And actually, you know what? No, I, I, I'm. What's the accuracy on this? Uh, yeah, it's 90. I was gonna say I, I'm gonna land it. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna land this. Take out the little Alchemy. Moonblast. Oh, for a second I thought it missed. I'm like, I swear, you can't aim. Dazzling Gleam. Ooh, man, that Dazzling Gleam though. That is a solid hit. I'm gonna go heal up because that is officially 10 trainers. I probably have a reward waiting for me. I might take another quick walk away from the mic. Because I think I think my uh, you can hear it in my voice. I got to take a sec here and clear my throat. Well, I'm certainly not finding any victory here. That's for sure. Sorry. Enjoy your uh, your failures. I'm sure you'll have to reflect hard on this. All right. Nito needs to go clear his throat. Nito needs to go heal up. Here I am in the rain. I have discovered the location of the Elite Four trial. Let's begin. Talk to me for the Elite Four trial, or the Elite trial, rather. This is the Elite Four, but it's not actually. Welcome to the Savannah Plaza. We're the team that supports Crispin of the Elite Four, and you're Nita Marquis, right? One of the BB League challengers. You'll need to hand over 50 BP. Uh, yeah, I'm willing to pay. I'm not using it. Here you go. Bro, we're, so we're soaking wet here. Can we, can we do this inside? Like, How is it even raining? It's a terrarium. Thank you very much. Do oh, because they have misters, I'm sure. That was a dumb question. Hey, Crispin, an order's just come in for you. Oh, you know what I didn't think about? Oh, my God. Dude, Crispin's probably a fire trainer, dude. Oh, hey, I saw you in the cafeteria. You're Nita Marquis, right? I just said four of my team is super effective or weak against fire. I mean, just the person to get my energy pumping. I feel like I'm cooking a nice simmer over here. But we got to move somewhere else for this next part. Oh, yeah, that's right. I got to I gotta do some kind of... Yeah, look at his mag mortar, dude. Well, at least it's raining, but I don't know if it's going to be raining during the battle. I am, uh, I've been waiting for a fiery challenger like you. Taking on the Elite Four pretty much right after coming to our school? Now that's lit. No wonder Kieran and Drayton like you. Yeah, I'm going to have to, what, like roll a rock around or something, kick a, kick a shoe. And if I'm being honest, you've kindled my curiosity, too. I should warn you, though, my trial is no cakewalk. My elite trial is putting together a super, sp super spicy sandwich. And I mean super spicy. I want something so hot it'll, be, it'll have me breathing flames. I know what you're thinking. That sounds easy, right? But you can't use your own ingredients. You've got to negotiate with the cl league club members around here to get what you need. Once you have all the right ingredients, come back and talk to me. Then I'll judge your sandwich making skills with my own two eyes. The key to cooking any dish is picking the right ingredients. The rest is easy as pie. Are you ready to take on my trial? I'm ready. All right. Uh, well, let's see what it's like, and I'll see if I skip. So, funny story, but at an art fair, there was this lady, this Mexican lady, that was cooking a lot of salsas, and... She sampled me a Reaper pepper salsa, and I wanted to try it because I thought I would die. So I had it, and it was delicious. It was really hot, but it was delicious. So I bought a jar, and here's what I think happened. I think she sampled me one salsa and sold me another. That Reaper pepper salsa is still in the kitchen, and it is it is so hot. Like, it is not what she sampled me. That <laughs> it, it is like you put that on your mouth in your mouth, and you cry for four hours. It's crazy. All right, well, it's not it's not raining anymore, so... All right, let's see what we got. Uh, I probably will cut all this out. Do you want mayonnaise? I'll share some with you, but only if you can defeat me. Oh! Okay, well, maybe I won't. Uh, it's mayo on now? Maybe I was wrong. Yeah, yeah we're, we're going to battle. Okay, so I've got Nuzlocke material here after all. You are challenged by Carmela the student. All right, well, I'm down for this. Pyroar and Pyroar. That's a sweet team, but again, with the whole fire type thing. Gee, I, I wonder, who do you think they're going to attack? Just wonder, huh? T take a guess. <laughs> all right, well, in that case, use Psychic on Pyroar. I was going to say, I was like, oh, man, dude, I'm going to have to, I'll, I'll get through this. So there are battles. I did not realize, ooh, overheat, yikes. Ooh. Ooh, that was a hit. 
I was going to say, why are you going for Raven? You should be going for Executor. That sucks. All right, well, at least he used... Okay, I was going to say, at least he used Overheat, so I've got my leftovers. Um, oh, man, dude, I swear. I, I gave myself items because I was realizing that I needed to up the levels of my Pokemon, and I needed... So you're going to be switching out for sure. I gave him items because I figure I'm like, you know what? I'm catching these Pokemon and going right into the Nuzlocke. There's no EV training. There's nothing here. I'm just diving in. Um, this is a tough call. I think I use a healing item here. So let's go healing item. I was going to say I could take out one of the Pyroars right now. She used overheat with that one. So that one's already going to be a lot weaker than it was. But I can't afford like I, I will take out Pyroar if I attack first. But I have no choice here. I have to heal up and attack that Pyroar because I need to be fresh for any other battles I might go on. Oh, oh now you use Yawn. Dude, I could have used... All right, if I knew you were doing that, I would have already used Psychic and took that one out. Now you're going to eat a Flamethrower. It's not going to hurt, but it hurts a lot more than I wish it did, though. And you're burned, of, co of course. This is not... Oh, my God. All right. Um, well, your special attack is down, so let's try to just... Let, let's just whip it out and kill. I say, I'm going to take you out with Psychic. You used another Yawn. I can't believe... First off, you outsped me, but I'm okay with that because you didn't attack. How are you both outspeeding? I thought I was faster than you. Holy crap. All right, take you out and then just land this Hydro Pump and take this thing out. Let's finish this up right now because if I get through this Elite Four, or I should say this Elite member, please land it. Thank you. If I, if I get through this unscathed and I, I, it's a miracle let me just get through this and then i swear i'll fix up this team to where they're not all weak against fire <laughs> i can't i shouldn't have started here this was a bad idea carmela says i may have underestimated you oh puns all right so here's some mayonnaise like i promised all right so if we have what probably three more battles because everyone over there was all ingredients Hey, she's healing me up. Nice. All right. So this guy's, uh, yep, three ingredients if you give me something. A battle. Man, I've got a hankering for some potato -y stuff. Uh, no, I, you know what? Actually, I don't. All right, so maybe that was the only battle. Maybe I'll just skip through all this. Beat me for potato salad. Never mind. There is, uh, there is one more battle. I was mistaken. I've got some potato salad if you want. You'll have to beat me in battle to get it. I'll battle you. I'll mash you like a potato. All right, let's rock. We're doing this. Julian, the student, we're doing this right now, right here. Camera up and Electros. Dude, what a, what a team. Okay, this is, wow, this, uh, this kind of sucks, actually. So, Electros. All right, I, you know what? I already see what you're going to do. Um, Electros can't do much. But I see what you're going to do. So, and the reason I see what you're going to do, go Leaf Storm and let's just full-blown assault on that camera up. He's going to Earthquake. I can see it coming. He's going to Earthquake because Electros has Levitate. There, take it out. Nice. Instantly outspeed Toast. Goodbye. Electros, I'm sorry, but you're, uh, you're two on one now. You're going to have some problems here. Discharge? Yeah, I was going to say, you don't have much you can do. I knew exactly where they were going with that. As soon as I figured that out, I was like, you're a ground type. I'm just thinking, okay, you have fire, so you're probably going to use fire. But I'm like, no, you're going to earthquake, and then I'm going to have to switch out, and it's going to be a disaster. I know exactly what they were doing. Um, all right, beat this thing up. If not that, then they were just going to use flamethrower on uh, executor. So it was good that I just rushed him. He has flamethrower. Oh, that could have been the worst thing in the world for me, man. I got lucky on that. There is no reason I survived other than that was not a stab move. Oh, man, dude. I hate when that stuff happens. You never know who's got fire moves. These Gen 5 Pokemon, man. I'm not familiar with them. Yes, I can hear the voice of the potato salad speaking to me now. I got a different voice in my head. All right, now I'm going to... I think I'm going to skip straight to the sandwich. I'm going to die against him. You know what? Crispin is going to destroy me. Literally, I have no chance. 
I'm going to lose so many Pokemon against him. All right, well, I got the potato salad. All right. So, fun fact: I have not made I have not made any sandwich yet. Um, so here, an ingredient. Yeah, we're gonna do that. We're gonna do that. Yeah, just throw all those on there. All right. Next, throw some mayonnaise on there and some vinegar, <laughs> and, and, and throw that on there. I have not made any sandwiches in this game. I, I yeah, I think maybe I made one because I remember there was a. I think I had to. I don't know, man. All right, let's uh, let's toss a cucumber on there. Uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna throw that in the middle because I need I need room for the chorizo. All right, so the chorizo can't I? T okay, fine. I can't I can't change I can't move that chorizo. I can't twist it. There's a chorizo. <laughs> Here, stick stick this in the middle there. There you go. Yeah, that's that that'll work. All right, here's some onion. The jalapeno is really the important part anyway, so this is the worst sandwich ever, dude. Are those onions raw? That's going to be a disaster. All right, well, here's uh, here's your jalapeno to make it super spicy. Here's another jalapeno. Throw that right there. There you go. That, that, that works. And then throw it right there. And then... Oh, okay, I was going to say, what about the mayonnaise? I thought I threw mayonnaise on it. All right, there's that. And then here's a pick. I'm sure this sandwich will be great. You'll love it. All done. Yeah, enjoy that. There's a tub of mayonnaise. You can just throw that on the sandwich, and there's some vinegar. Soak the bread in that vinegar, and you're good to go. Delicious. All right, let's see what you got. Is it just the jalapenos is all you needed? Ah. Uh, I blew it. All right, this sandwich sucks just as bad as the other ones, but I literally have everything I can have, man. I traded everybody everything. The only thing I don't have is ketchup. There's no way that this sandwich needs ketchup. Come on, this has got to be good. I got olive oil. I got I got everything you need, man. Come on. The only thing I can imagine is that I needed the chili sauce. I didn't see that that was in there already. Hey, that looks good. We good? All right, good. It was the chili sauce I was missing. All right, well, time to uh, time to battle this guy with all his fire types. I've been battling fire trainers since Blaine, man. I can take you down. I can tell the spicy souls of the world all agree with me. You put spicy ingredients to good use. Me? I could have handled something a bit spicier, really, but it was still good. All that means is you passed my elite trial, no problem at all. Cleared. Here's a thumbs up from Nito. Time to go die, literally. I'm I, 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 Lapras, you're going to be like, God, Lapras, I'm going to be hoping that... It, Lapras is pretty much my crutch. I'm going to enjoy the tingle on my tongue as we head back to the plaza. We're just going right into this? Well, that wraps up the trial, so now it's time to face me in an elite battle. You all prepped to take me on? No, I'm I'm not. I literally need a sec. Uh, I need to strategize. Don't worry, I get it. Battles are... All right, I need to check what other Pokemon I have in this Nuzlocke, because I can't just run into you. Like I, This is going to take time and planning, bro. Be right back. Hey, you need a marquee, you all prepped. All right, let's uh, let's do this. Dude, I'm, I'm really struggling here to use these. Uh, my, my comp is just suffering. Coming right up. Watch out, because I'm cranking out the heat. My comp is suffering so badly here. 
I brought out Dugong, though, so you're going down, man. So, Nino Marquis, I take it there's a messy, messy history between you and Kieran, huh? And it sure does seem like Drayton's cooking up something fishy, too. Everything's getting so complicated. Can't you just get over yourselves? If you want to say something, say it. If you want to do something, just do it. I'm the kind of guy who wastes time, no time sweating the small stuff. I battle because I want to battle. And you know what? That's how it should be. I'm Crispin, the Elite Four rep in this Savannah Dome biome. If you want to win, so that's I want to win, so that's exactly what I'll do. All right, let's rock. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like that. Oh, I thought he was going to throw the ball with the skillet. I guess not. Whatever, it's still kind of cool. Ooh. Rotom's oven form. I don't like this. Now then, time to get cooking. Wait, no. Time to start battling. Uh, I'm going to use my opening move, I think, is Rain Dance. And let's try to take out Rotom before he's dropping Thunderbolts on us. Drops a sunny day. That's why I have so many Rain Dances. This is going to be per- Oh, Willow Wisp! Maybe you don't have Thunderbolt. Oh, you screwed up. You don't have Thunderbolt. I'm going to hit Rain Dance, Hydro Pump, and you are done, dude. All right, here it goes. Man, this... I'm struggling with the comp. These guys are no joke, are they? Don't... Please, please, please. Ah. Uh, dude, he missed. All right, that was an easy kill. You Lapras, you just missed an easy takeout. I have an idea. I think I'm going to use Charm, and let's take out this guy. All right, so he's stuck on Sunny Day. I was going to say, if I use Charm, I hate to do it this way. You, you really don't have Thunderbolt, do you? You're using Hex after the burn. I hate to do it this way, but I think based on... I'm struggling with comp and moves and everything. I, I, I don't have that many Pokemon allotted to me. That didn't do nearly as much as I thought. You're really going to douse our flames if you keep using moves like that. Ugh, this sucks, dude. I'm already down. I was going to say, I could just make Talonflame a dead duck. Let me rain dance here. And you know what? Let me burn up my first uh, My first healing item of three is going on Lapras right now. Let's use let's use uh, my rain dance. And he's going to be using Hex. Uh, what's Talonflame going to use? I'm guessing Flare Blitz. Flame Blitz. Flare Blitz. And he does use Flare Blitz. Ooh, that does so much more than I wanted it to. I was going to say, I'm going to make a dead duck. Oh, he's got overheat. Okay, hold it off. Crap, dude, this is terrible. His special attack is down. Talonflame's attack is down. I was going to say, I could make a dead duck out of this. I hate to do that as my strategy, but I'm, this, this is like the worst Elite Four member for me, and I'm charging in early in the Nuzlocke. So... I'm going to make a dead duck out of him. He's going to have no attack, and you're going to heal up. Yeah, you're going to heal up. I'm going to do this. Uh, second healing item right now. I only have one more healing item for this entire battle. I hate to do it this way. It's kind of scummy, but I'm guessing he's not going to switch out Talonflame. We're making a dead duck out of Talonflame. He's going to have such a low attack that there's nothing he's going to be able to do anymore. Oh, he's got it! Oh, okay, okay. His special attack is down thanks to that overheat. In fact, they have kind of screwed... They screwed up. He's lowered on his special attack. He's four stages down on attack. I actually might be able to just use this as a setup moment. He won't switch out. Crispin won't switch... Well, actually, I'm assuming he won't switch out. Um, let's, let's take his attack down six stages and rain dance. This should not do much. It does so much more than I wish it would, though. I was going to say, I'm going to... Yeah, you know what? Take him down... He's four stages down now. Okay, this is what we're going to do. I've got this. We're going to heal up Lapras. He's four stages down. I am mistaken. It's Rotom that's going to be the dead duck. He's going to be sitting out there with no ability to deal out any more damage. I'm going to take Talonflame out. I'm going to set up a Stealth Rock. So I'm going to get out of here with Gardevoir. Set up a Stealth Rock. Have my setup all complete. I blew all my healing items, or at least close to. I have one more left. Um, early. And then... Let's go, you know what, uh, do I go for it? Do I go for it? Yeah, let's try it. All right. Yeah, this, this is not, <laughs> this is not how this battle was supposed to go. This is the, I haven't even, dude, 
I'm spending all this time on uh, on setting up, and I haven't even gotten past the first two Pokemon. Here's his sunny day, so this Hydro Pump is not going to do anything if it even goes off. I have to overcome paralysis and bad accuracy checks on it, and I'm going to have to heal Lapras. It hits. How bad does it hit him? It does a decent damage, but honestly, that's it could be so much more. All right. Let me think here. I think we go for the Stealth Rock. Do I heal Lapras? Do I heal Lapras or do I attack? Rain Dance or heal? I think... Yeah, let's do this. Full Restore. Final healing item. It's all done. No healing items left. That was everything I had. Here it goes. I'm going to set up the Stealth Rock and I'm probably going to thank myself. Good. He's using Roost. These two have such low stats right now. Talonflame is actually a little... Oh, oh, perfect. He's going down six stages. He's doing nothing. He's the dead duck, dude. So if Crispin was smart, and unfortunately the AI doesn't do this unless you're champion level, they uh, they won't have him swap out that, that Pokemon, any of those Pokemon, because those things are literally... You know what? Actually, let me, let me set up with Cosmic Power. Screw it. I, they're so... Do I... Yeah, let me do it. I am so indecisive right now. Hit a rain dance and let's go. Perfect. He uses Roost. They won't switch out their Pokemon, and if he did, he would be a huge threat. Look, this is going to do nothing. Ooh, it did a little more than I thought it was. That Thunderbolt on a flying rock type, man. I hate that. <laughs> Minior is a sweet Pokemon, but I'm going to try to get out of here with no deaths. Let's try this. I'm going to set up, and now I think we take him out. Um... Uh, Take out. Yeah, let's do the rain dance. Yep, perfect. I called it. I was going to say, I don't want that sunny day out because I already can tell you he's going to be dropping fire attacks under sunny day. Yikes, that still does more than I wish it would. I don't want him dropping fire attacks. I don't want him switching into Charizard and using solar beam. I don't want any of this. Oh, that hits hard, dude. All right, finish him off, and let's uh, let's keep the rain dance up. He, uh, is he gonna roost? Yeah, dang it! All right, I was gonna say I could have put Rotom to sleep possibly instead, but I just wasted that move. But I couldn't afford to. Are you gonna miss? He misses. Perfect. You you and I canceled each other out because my rain dance isn't gonna do anything. But your Will O Wisp missed. Take him out. Goodbye. You're still hanging on. What the heck? Finish this fool off, dude. Let's Ice Beam him and just kill him. Good. He uses Roost. I was going to say, uh, I'll set up the Sunny Day afterwards. Just take this thing out, dude. Hold it off. Hold it off. Hold it off. Okay, good. It does nothing now. Ice Beam. Hit him. Oh, that does nothing, too. Jeez. Fire Flying, man. I'm telling you, what a type. That's one of the best flying, one of the best base flying Pokemon in all of Pokemon. Sorry, Pidgeot, but Talonflame is such a badass. All right, Executor, see? He was going to be dropping solar beams on me, but it's raining, so it sucks to be you. And you get hit by the... Oh, that's... I'm so glad I set that up. All right, so now what do I do? I shouldn't have kept Explosion on this thing, by the way. That was stupid. I did it for the memes, man, but they're all double battles. Let's hit this Executor with everything we got. All right, sweet. We're holding this off, man. We're holding this off. Freeze him. It hits hard. It should have hit harder, but whatever. Freeze it. Ooh, Citrus Berry? Citrus Berry. Citrus Berry? Oh, he's got a Citrus Berry. All right. D oh, dude, don't tell me he's got Harvest. He's going to be using the Harvest Citrus Berries, isn't he? I swear, if you have Harvest, this isn't going to do much. I'm going to have to... Oh, my God, it does nothing. I was hoping to just a little bit more. All right. Minior's jacked up now. My only question is, I outspeed everything on the field now, but I'm going to have to get out of there. I have no choice. I'm going to send my own Executor out, and then, oops, Ice Beam this thing, and it's not going to kill, but let's do it anyways. Get that freeze. Get that freeze. Come on. Dude, th what, is this, what is this battle turning into? I'm, I'm using junk strategy at this point. Good predict. Ow, oh, come on, dude. All right, you know what? If I'm going to get paralyzed, I give me the freeze. I deserve this. Freeze him. My God. All right, so now what? Rain stop. Do I rain dance again? There is his harvest. Predicted, predicted, predicted. I knew you would have harvest. 
All right, so how do I want to do this? Do I take out Executor? And uh, you know what? Let's go protect. I'm going to bait out both of them. They're both going to attack me. Come on. Well, what? We have the same move sets. All right, so this is a useless move. If he goes for anything on my Executor with Rotom, then we literally just traded protects. Hex on the... Yeah, because I was paralyzed. So, yeah, that was a useless move. <laughs> I wish I thought he would have Protect. I would have used Rain Dance. Now I feel like I wasted my time. All right. Well, our Protect's canceled out. Let's go Reflect. Let's just set it up for the next Pokemon. Finish off this Executor. Eat that Hex. It can't do that much. It's super effective and you're paralyzed, but he's got six stages down. He's the dead duck. I'm kind of abusing the AI on that because a human would have switched out after the first drop, but hey... I'm not exactly using my best strategy in the world either here. I feel like I am fumbling through this. Like, this is not VGC. <laughs> I am not employing VGC strats here. This is just me tumbling through this. Magmortar? Oh, yeah. Magmortar. Um, I'm going to switch out. And uh, do I go to Dugong? Yeah, I go to Dugong. I'm sorry. Whoops. Go to Dugong. Um... Yeah, let's go to Dugong, and let's go Rain Dance. And then I set up the Rain Dance. Man, you, do you have any idea how cool it would be if Dugong had freaking uh, uh, Swift Swim? All right, there's the Hex. Does nothing. Yep, that's about what I thought. What do you have? Thunderbolt. Ooh. Uh, no. Dang it, dude. I had a feeling. I didn't even think about that. You want to talk about VGC, that was... I should have thought about that. Oh, my God. That was such an obvious Thunderbolt. All right. Let's go uh, Rain Dance here, and then you are Terrastalizing and Brick Break this guy in the freaking face. I'm going to bait Flamethrower or Overheat or anything, whatever they've got. I'm going to bait it onto, onto uh, Crab Rawler or Crab Abominable. Which, by the way, that shiny Crab Rawler I found... Um, I threw it in the wrong ball. It doesn't matter. I threw it in a dive ball. I thought the colors are blue on him. He looks like a lobster, but uh, let me know if that's a legal encounter or not. I caught him outside of this area, but it was a shiny... Oh, what the heck? You do so much more. All right, we've got to get that freaking rain going here, dude. That does so much more than I thought. Rain dance, come on. Brick break him in the face and kill this mag motor. One shot. Come on. One shot in the face. Yeah, I should have used close combat. Use an Aqua Jet and just kill this thing. Instant priority, you're done. Uh, Iron Defense, I don't know what he's going to have, but if he has anything physical... What did you... Did you was that a Chapelberry? Did you just Chapelberry me? Oh, Pasho Berry. Sorry, you Pasho Berried me. Well, it didn't help, did it? I have the rain, so that pretty much canceled out the Pasho Berry, and then my priority move took him out. Willow Wisp on... Yep, Crabominable. You cut my attack in half. That sucks. Um, I forget what ability Crabominable has. I think it, I think it doubles his weight. I think no, that's that's sorry. That was um, that was Doraludon that had that Drawludon. What do you have? I don't remember your ability. Oh, Camrop, dude, perfect. Oh, Camrop, you're gonna die, man. But I'm gonna kill him before he drops that earthquake. All hands on deck. Aqua Tail, Brick Break in the face. I'm gonna save my close combat. Will-O-Wisp, perfect. Not perfect. Ah, oh, that was a physical attack, dude. He just cut my attack in half. I know I have the rain, but still. Please do not pay for that. I swear to God, if I have to pay for that, that should have killed. This better kill. If I have to answer for that, Will-O-Wisp. Oh my God. If, I, if you kill me, I'm going to be so pissed. Oh my God. Dude, what am I doing? Why didn't I go for close combat? I'm an idiot. That is such... That was me. That was me, dude. Thank you for the hydration. I didn't think that was even going to go off, to be honest. Oh, God. you got to be kidding me. Let's get uh, let's get Executor out here. I know he's paralyzed, so this is a huge risk. I'm an idiot for not going for close combat. Aqua Jet, take him out. And then Executor, let's just put up a Reflect again. Dude, what the heck? Oh, my God. 
I can't believe I did that. I should have used close combat. <laughs> that hit harder than I wanted it to, and I'm paralyzed. This is going to be the riskiest move of all time. I'm going to bait Blaziken. Oh, now I wish I had that reflect, dude. Don't tell me he's going to terrestrialize. Are you going to terrestrialize that Blaziken? Go for Aqua Tail in the rain. Let's get that protect. Arceus, give me this protect. Time to terrestrialize. Really turn up the heat. Oh my god. I love that he puts it in the skillet. That's amazing. Um, I am not losing another Pokemon. Protect. Bait it. Whatever he's got. Blaze Kick coming in hot, I'm sure. Hex blocked. Nice. Blaze Kick on Executor. Blaze Kick. Shadow Claw on Executor. Okay, I was like, for a second, I thought he attacked Dugong. All right, kill him. One shot. One shot. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. I've got the priority moved. Uh, the priority move is going to take him out. Speed boost, I don't even care. Unless you also have a freaking Pasho Berry. Uh, I'm going to push my luck, man. Screw it. <laughs> Double protect. Double protect. Yeah! I can't believe I just got the double protect. Oh my god, dude. Take him out. Done. Ah. Oh. I never should have lost Crabominable. But I guess it really doesn't matter, honestly. If I had lost Crabominable, then I or if I hadn't lost Crabominable, then I probably would have lost him there anyways. Oh, dude, that was hilarious. Oh my god. Even if he uses overheat now, it's not gonna kill. So all hands on deck, let's just kill. I keep doing that. I keep going down and side beam. Let's take him out. Overheat. Not going to kill. Dear Lord, dude. Why can't I escape? What is wrong with me? I just keep paying for it and paying for it and paying for it. Oh, my God, dude. Executor, you should have ate that. He has a rocky helmet on that thing. Oh, my God. What? what? I lost three Pokemon in this, dude. Holy crap. This Nuzlocke is going to be insane if I'm already this many Pokemon down and I have three more Elite Four members to go, dude. This is stupid. Oh my god, I'm getting my ass whooped. You didn't even die from that? Please, come on. I want to keep my Minior. Thank you. Will-O-Wisp on the Dugong. Dude, that was the biggest crap I've ever seen when that Will-O-Wisp hit my Dugong. I am an idiot. Let me know if that shiny Crab Rawler counts. If that counts, even though I didn't catch it at Blueberry Academy, I caught it while I was doing the Nuzlocke, you let me know, does that count? Oh, dude, three deaths. Oh, my God, this is no freaking joke. I wanted to win, but I lost. Oh, what is going on? That was amazing. We cranked the heat all the way up, eh, Nito Marquis? I love battles and I love cooking because they're so, both so easy to understand. In battles, you either win or lose. With cooking, your dish is either spicy or not spicy. Simple, right? But right now, the mood of the League Club feels off. It's frustrating. I wish I knew how we could go back to being the fun club we were before. But hey, didn't mean to douse the flames there. You were real strong. Oh my god, dude. Let me see if I can transfer the burning heat from our battle into my frying pan. I'll whip up something great. Yeah, whip up a magical cure for uh, bringing back a Pokemon that's dead in a Nuzlocke. I do like that. That's hilarious. No, you should be burning your hand, though, dude. That handle is so hot at this point. Your, your hand. Here, I'll also give you one of my favorite moves. He's holding in a, a skillet with a metal handle. He would... Uh, temper flame, nice. Uh, his hand would be totally burned heating up that skillet. <laughs> oh, my God. I can't believe three deaths, dude. I've got no clue how to manage the temperature of anything besides what I'm cooking. So all I can say is, crank up the heat all you want in the BB League. Dude. Dude. That was crazy. That better be my hardest one. Yo, champ in the making. That better have been my hardest one. That's one Elite Four member beat. Things are looking good for you. Crispin's no pushover. He's just a straightforward, or super straightforward. I think that's kind of part of his charm, you know? We used to all chow down on Crispin's cooking after the club activities let out. 
Those were the days. Guess he's been worrying about the way things are, too, in his own way. You, uh, you just might be the one we need to shake things up in the league club. That's it from me. That better have been the hardest. Good luck with the remaining Elite Three. Yeah, I got three more, man. That better have been the hardest one. Holy crap. I recognize that I'm using Nuzlocke Pokemon. They are not EV trained. Look at that. Look at the look at this battle damage, dude. I used all three of my healing items. I set up early, and that's what happened to me. I did I was making stupid mistakes there, but even then, there's only so much you can do, dude. That's insane. I'm gonna leave it off here. I think every Elite Four member should have their own. You know what? That's what I'm gonna do. Every Elite Four member has their own episode. I'll catch more Pokemon as I deem fit. And I will battle trainers on the way to the Elite Four members. I think that's a good way to leave it. So, humble and proud. I'm Nino Marquis. Let me know if that shiny counts as an encounter. And holy crap, this team got decimated. I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. Truly, I hope you're enjoying it. Uh, if anything, I hope you're enjoying my death. Later.